Hello guys. Today I've been having fun with my two laptops. My goal for today was to connect them together with a parallel cable to copy files and uh, with a serial cable uh, to play games head to head. So I'm going to share with you what I've uh, done so far. Um, as you can see, I've uh, opened the BIOS settings on both computers. The reason for that is I want to show you um, the best settings uh, to get the best speed, especially for the parallel cable. As you can see here, my LPT extended mode is set to ECP mode. And the reason for that, I can choose here between, uh, oh, I was wrong, key. I can choose between standard, that's slow, 4-bit mode, very, very slow. Um, and we have ECP mode, that is a lot faster. And ECP mode, which is even faster. You can actually get 800 kilobit per second in this mode. That is almost the same speed as an ISA bus. Uh, on the other computer, I've uh, done the same. Here I can set some more uh, settings. You can see that also uh, I can change the uh, address, the IRQ and the DMA channel for the printer port. I'm just going to leave it here on the default so it doesn't mess up and, and conflicts with my other uh, devices especially my sound blaster. Um, let's go back and just have a look also on the COM port. Uh, on this machine it's set to auto. On this machine it is set to COM1 uh, and you see the address and the IRQ there. That's the default setting. I expect this to be the same addresses when it's set to auto. So this is the best, the, this will give you the best speeds. Let me exit the uh, BIOS on these two machines. And let's boot up. And first we will start uh, Laplink and to just copy across some files, just see if it's working. Yeah, just booting up. I got these machines uh, uh, fairly cheap. I can't remember how I got the Sharp, but uh, the Toshiba I bought on the internet uh, worked fine. Oh, I have a disk in there. Let's okay on the on the Sharp. I've uh, I have actually SS um, a compact flash card on both machines. On um, the Toshiba here, I have a eight gig compact flash card with FreeDOS one point zero. And on the Sharp, I have a two gigabyte uh, compact flash card uh, with MS-DOS 6.22 uh, and 4DOS. Uh, let me just, uh, I prefer Norton Commander to choose to go around. Um, Laplink 5. And the other machine. Apps. Lap link five. And this, if it, everything is going as it should, uh, it should automatically detect the other machine. And there it uh, detected this. If I see on this computer, you see. Uh, it detected Toshiba, which is the other machine, on both cum N because I've connected both cum N and lpt N cables. Mm -hmm. Let me show you. Uh, this is my Laplink cum N cable. As you can see, I have both uh, 9 and 25 pin in both ends. This is the 25 pin and the 9 pin is going into the Toshiba. I've had this cable for years. I'm glad I have it. Um, this is my parallel cable. It goes into the printer port on both machines. And it's a specially made parallel cable, also called a Laplink cable. Okay, 
So from the Sharp, I'm going to choose to connect it to Shiba through the LPT port. Choose to go to the C drive. And then I have both drives up here. I'll copy some th something across just to uh, do a test. Let's copy WordPerfect 5.1 over to the Toshiba. Let me press F2 for copy. Oh, maybe I did something wrong here. Mm. No, F2. And there it's copying. The reason it's called <laughs> Toshiba both on source and target is I copied the lap link uh, from the Toshiba uh, a few hours earlier today. So it's the same name. I can show you afterwards how you change the name. You see it's uh, going fairly quick. Uh, it's about 2 megabytes and it doesn't take many seconds to copy the 2 megabytes across. That's with a parallel cable. Okay. I'll show you also let's go into options and computer name and rename this sharp oh, so we don't have any confusion in the future okay that was uh, my Laplink demonstration. Now I'm going to exit Laplink and uh, on both machines, and I'm going to start Doom. Let's uh, do Doom 2 games. Doom 2, and we have to start it with setup. As you know, I've, I have still connected the serial cable. Uh, games. Doom 2. Setup. Okay. Save. Uh, no. Run network. Modem serial game. Serial link. And I just press FT, F10 to go. I'll do the same here. Um, and F10. And as you can see on both machines now, they have connected, they found each other. And they are booting up the game. And we are now playing together. Let me show you. I turn around and there's the other guy. Oh my god, oh, look. Nice, easy, fun. Now I just need somebody to play with. See you around. Thanks for watching. Bye.